Okay, so <clears throat> sorry. it's now 7.03 p.m. on Saturday, June 10th, and I am getting ready to head out to do a little bit of shopping. Not very much, just some basic supplies. Stuttered a bit there. A uh, birthday card for my grand, and hopefully a gift of some sort. I have very little money to work with here, so yeah. Um, <clears throat> so, I'm basically finally saying to hell with what society expects and embracing my own natural circadian rhythm. Um, yeah, so I don't have an official diagnosis yet, um, <clears throat> but I am fairly confident that I have delayed sleep phase syndrome. I will put... I'll find my um, spreadsheet and put it here, somewhere in the video. Yeah. <clears throat> and to let you know, like, hey, this is my natural sleep cycle, because that's one advantage of not having a job, is I can actually fall asleep and wake up fairly naturally most days. I mean, there's some, like, I sleep right by the window. There's, like, the road is, like, right by here. That came out really redneck. So, like, if a car goes by, there's, like, a really loud car car driving by motorcycle, the neighbor mows his yard, that's gonna wake me up. But for the most part, I can fall asleep and wake up when I, I can go to sleep when I'm actually sleepy and wake up when I'm ready to naturally wake up. And <clears throat> in doing so, like, I found my natural sleep cycle, which is pretty much completely bass backwards. Like, I go to like I get sleepy when the sun comes up around 7, 8 in the morning is when I naturally want to fall asleep. And I do, and I wake up between noon and 3-ish. So, yeah, um, so still looking for a second to third shift job. We'll see how that goes. I ha um, I'm, I've applied for an online job. I've got to take an exam, but first I need to do my online, my shopping, so I can come back here and fully focus on it, because I need to study for it, and then do it within the week. Right now, I am trying to clear off my phone, so pardon the, me being slightly distracted. Okay, my phone is full. I want to free it up before I head out in case there's something I want to take a picture of or vlog or what have you. Um, okay, so this camera. I'm going to put this in the way. And <clears throat> i got like some kind of sinus thing going on. Also, it's hotter than the Dickens in here because apparently, despite being fixed last year, my AC doesn't work again. And this unit thing I have beside me, it likes to leak. I don't know what to do with that. It's like, I use it and I end up with puddle. I end up with like puddles in my carpet. So, the best thing I can do is get out of the house. Yay! Huh. I'm gonna have to find a job and I don't know why my nose keeps itching. I use this like makeup and it's like itchy, but whatever. Okay. Let's get this going. And. Okay, I make a new folder for the eighth. And where did my mouse go? There it is. I'm gonna have to um, clear off my computer a bit soon because it's starting to get full and it's getting a bit slow. Probably because of the this the files like this I've been doing. I've still got all of January's on here, and as soon as I get all of February, I got like one more day for February to finish up, and then I'll put that on my external hard drive and get January and February cleared off the computer so that it should free up some room. Um, let's see, I need... I think, I'm thinking about getting the Roku Express for my grand. I, I, we'll see. Um, <clears throat> it's what I can afford, because I've got like $25 on the... Got some lovely debt going on right now. It's awesome. Because I have bills, and I have no money to pay the bills, so the bills have to go on the credit card. Yay! <coughs> Yeah, that's nasty. Um, but yeah. Um. And as someone who has dealt with that, I'm like, I've lived without internet and cable. Yeah, y you need one or the other for san- like, I know it's not- you don't need it to live, but I do need it for my sanity. Because sitting around with nothing but the radio is, like, impossibly boring. Like, like, I, I need it, so. Um. Pay for that. Ooh. Overshot. There's the night. <coughs> I wish I could pause this. Uh, like, I, maybe it's because it's so hot in here that I'm getting, like, congested. I, I don't know. 
I'm just like rambling random crap right now while I'm transferring files so I can run out the door. And I must wait for my tuna polish to dry. Yay! Um, this oh no, so transferring. Usually I just go to Kmart and get my grand some kind of jewelry something. But I got, what did I get her for her birthday? I got her a necklace for her birthday. And I want to get her one for, uh, like, I, I want to get her one of those monogram necklaces. But I need to wait for Christmas for that because hopefully I'll have a job by Christmas. Hopefully. <laughs> and I'll be able to afford one then. So that, I, I'm not, that's too much jewelry. Like, she has dressers. Of, she doesn't have, like, a drawer of jewelry or, like, a, like a jewelry chest. I'm talking full, we have full-blown dressers. And if anyone's thinking of robbing, tracking me down and robbing my house, um, it's mostly costume jewelry that isn't worth much, so could keep your hopes down. And also, we have a gun cabinet, so there you go. Just delete that. <coughs> um, let's see what else. Still doing genealogy? I don't know where I'm, I don't know what to talk about right now. Because basically, I'm just transferring files. Folder for the tenth. What did I take a? Oh, that was lovely. That's the one thing about having delayed, having a really messed up sleep cycle. I get my like, I never know what day it is. Like, just to me, today will last from when I wake up. Actually, I woke up around noon and fell back asleep. So to, for me, today last between is going to last between noon and eight o'clock in the morning tomorrow. I mean. I don't need, why am I doing air quotes? Because it, it technically is tomorrow, but for, for me, it's today. Yay, confusion. Just delete that. Just kept, this kept, okay, Hermie in there. <clears throat> and tomorrow we have a family reunion. It's for my pop's family. I, I'm going, like, I've been to family reunions, but I've never been to my own family reunion. Like, I've like I've been to several of my pops' family reunions, and I've been to my friends' family reunion. Like I keep going to other people's family reunions. Go figure. And delete this. I mean, technically they're my family. I'm just not blood related to them. But yeah, it's it's a little weird. To, like, go to family reunions and not really look like anybody there. At the same time. Um, I think because I was raised by my grand or AK grand who is biologically my first cousin once removed and her husband and their families, like seeing people who resemble me feels weird. Like I like I'm used to it now because I'm like because of my younger cousins I've been around it more. But there's something about families and like kids who look a lot like their parents that kind of weirds me out. I mean, yeah, duh, genetics, but st just there's something about it that, like, w like, r like back in the past, really weirded me out. It's like, you know, those kids who look like their parents gave birth to their own clone, that kind of resemblance. Um, but like, cause my cousins were like that a lot, um, cause, um, I I might make a video on that later on. This video is all like eight nearly nine minutes and I'm starting to get kind of like not stuttery but like pause stuttery if that makes any sense so I'm gonna go and you'll see me later bye alrighty so it's 8 16 and I am sitting in the local ish Kmart parking lot yeah I didn't find anything there are a few things I needed this guy's like getting in his car in front of me um, so I was going to get my grand a gift, maybe a, like a birthday card, a few personal products and makeup. Yeah, and I had a gift card for a little under $8. Uh, didn't find anything. I mean, they had some stuff, but not for the price I'm willing to pay. And I don't want to buy, like, the cheapest gift, like, gift card, not gift card, cheapest, like, greeting card they had for, like, grandmother specifically was like $4.99. I ain't paying $4.99 for a card that, you know, may or may not be kept. I don't want to pay, like, nah. And I didn't have any, like, like, no Kmart within 50 miles of me has the Roku right now, which is awesome. Uh, so I'm going to have to go to Target, I guess, and try there. See, they've got it, and maybe some... 
for pads and panty liners. You so needed to know that. But the, I went to buy the store brand the, and the Kmart store brand and the lady products are kind of crappy. And I don't want to pay $8 for pads. TMI, but there you go. I'm cheap. It's not, they're like, I think like $4.99. No, not really $8. They're like $4.99 and up. And I'm too cheap for that. So I'm going to go to Target and maybe Kohl's. See if they have it, and then come back down here and go to the Walmart grocery store and pick up a loaf of bread. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it is dark. Um. Okay, that's a little bit of light. So it's 9:09 .09 p.m. and I'm now sitting in the Target parking lot. I finally found most of what I needed. I got my grand birthday gift. I got her a card. Forgot to get a gift bag, so I'm gonna go to Dollar General later to get that because like nine already. I um, got two boxes of cereal and some lady products that I'm gonna try out. Um, Cause she, I got the Target. Like I'm testing out the store brand of things, cause I use different product. I use one of those cup things now, so I don't really need as many. Like a box of pads and thing. Like a, will last me several months now, as opposed to before. Actually, that should last me the rest of the year. Actually, I think. But I also don't want to pay full price for the real items, you know, so too much information there, but I mean, whatever. So I still need a loaf of bread. But it's like, I'm still, it's like, I, I've embraced my new, my natural sleep cycle, but it still feels weird to go shopping this late at night. Because like I have a limited window of when I can go buy things because most stores close at 10 maybe. 9, 10, somewhere in there, so I don't know what time the Walmart grocery closes, I'm going to go find out. Alright, now it's 10, 13, I am finally home, I got home around 10, then I had a text back and forth with my grand because we had the family reunion tomorrow, and got to figure out when that is, and I look like I'm wearing that thing as a little hair piece, I don't know if they're, yeah, no. Anyhow, so, I'm going to pop my pop my drink back in the freezer yeah, there's my arm hey I'm like okay that's stupid um and let that freeze a bit and then I guess I'm gonna eat lunch or whatever you want to call it and yes it's like 10 13 p.m. so this is so weird but I, I, I like it in the way that I, I feel like I feel awake like I should be awake at like 10 something in the morning and not 10 at night, but apparently my circadian rhythm is completely ass backwards. Yeah, so I'm just going to embrace it and see what happens. Hopefully I'll get a job somewhere. I don't know, Walmart 24, if all else fills, Walmart 24 hours. I'd really rather not work at Walmart because it sucks, um, but yeah. So this is what I got my grand for her birthday. I think that was, yeah. Um, it was $39.99, I just, credit card, I mean, I, I had some cash, so, yeah. Got a few groceries. Got this, do I, don't know if I have a gift bag for that. Might have to go to Dollar General. I know I completely forgot to get half, I got two boxes of cereal and completely forgot to get milk. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyhow, plus it was... I didn't want to travel that far with milk because it's in another county, but yeah. And then, and yes, there's a chair full of crap behind me because that's how I roll, so yeah. Whatever. Got her this card. This card isn't really her personality. I just kept looking at it. I'm like, oh, what the heck, I'm going to buy this card. There you go. It's, I mean, I guess it's kind of, basically it was three sixty nine because my cheap ass did not want to pay $5 for a card. That said basically the same thing as every other grandmother card out there that ha has ever said. I worded that awesome, but w just go with it. Yeah. So, I got that and that. I'm trying to get something that wasn't jewelry for the umpteenth time. And, like, so. Still don't, rem like, I don't remember how much the monogram necklaces were at the local boutique. And... Yeah, I got some trash I need to take out. See, yeah, trash bags, they're full on the door. Yeah. Um, and, like, also, hold on, I got this. Technically not gluten-free, but it, does, it doesn't It does contain any gluten ingredients. But it's also not gluten-free, but I can still eat it because it doesn't contain gluten ingredients. So, whatever. And then this, and then mac, and then gluten-free mac and cheese and tuna. 
So, like, they had several different styles of, um, the monogram, like, the different fonts, and I can't remember which, uh, turn the light on, which one she liked, because, like, I showed them to her before, and she told me which one she liked, but I can't remember which one it was, because I just remember it wasn't, like, the kind I liked. Like, it was, like, she has different tastes than me. It was some kind of cursive script, but I can't remember which one. Yeah. Anyhow, so, hmm. What else? I think that's about it. My day's been pretty boring. I mean, technically my day's starting, so we're not, I'm not like, when I say I'm embracing my circadian rhythm, I've been doing that forever. Um, at least trying to, when I don't have a job. But I'm just, like, like, I think I put that, um, chart in there. And lately, it's been like this, where I get up around noon, fall back asleep, get up around 3 or 4 in the afternoon, and go to bed between this 8, 9 in the morning. I went to bed around 9 this morning today for reasons. Um... So basically, my AM and PM are completely backwards. I, like, like, it's not what I would consider a normal sleep schedule, even if, like, if you reversed my AM and my PM, like, my mornings and my, like, my wake up and my go to sleep times, it still wouldn't be quite normal. Like, basically, I'm like a person who goes to bed around 8 or 9 and gets up at 3 in the morning. Still, not, like, not completely... I mean, I'm sure there's people who do that, but to me that still seems extreme. I mean, I'm... Com yeah, so I... I don't, know, I, I don't know how to word this, but, like, I know what I mean, I just can't get it out of my mouth in a way that makes sense. So hopefully someone out there is making some sense of this. But anyhow, so, I'm usually up now anyway, but... I'm so used to having it ingrained in my head that this is when I'm supposed to be asleep. You're supposed to be relaxing, or getting, like, you know, to get up for the day when the sun's up tomorrow. And so, you know, you shouldn't do anything strenuous, you shouldn't run around, like... And so, like, I sit here and, like, I just chill, do nothing much, thinking, you know, oh, I'll get tired and fall asleep eventually, but no, that never happens. Like... So, I'm just, I'm just going to say, I'm just saying, screw it. I'm going to treat tonight like it's daytime. Like, I'm going to eat lunch around midnight instead of noon. Going to do a bit of cleaning. See how that goes and go to sleep when I'm sleepy. Granted, I have a family reunion tomorrow and I need to be at my grandparents' house at 11 a.m. Which would be, yeah. So, that's kind of interesting. Their reunion's at 1. So... And just, Im like, imagine you're a person who, I guess, gets up and goes to sleep at a normal time, like, okay, maybe not at 3 o'clock in the morning, but let's you say you're a person who gets up around 5 to 7 in the morning, and you go to bed between 10 and midnight. It's one of those types of people. And you have a family reunion, sorry, and then you have a family reunion at 1 o'clock in the morning. Till whenever. And, yeah, it's, it's kind of like that. It's going to be like that, but... I mean, it's basically what I've been doing forever, so, yeah. Um, I guess I'm just going to be really hyped up on caffeine tomorrow. Although I have learned, if you are sleep deprived, like really sleep deprived, stay away from, don't immediately go for the coffee, because like, for me at least, that makes me even more sleepy, I think, because like, I'm dehydrated because I haven't drank much of anything. Um, but I'm going to try to maybe drink... Some, not this one, but one of these types of things first, and then drink coffee, see how that goes. And, we'll see, so we'll just see, if I'm awake or whatever. This, I feel like this video, t today's video is a little, like, kind of rambly, but, I mean, I went shopping at, like, night time, so, the lighting is crappy, so, I mean, yeah. Oh, and the Walmart is 24, yeah, the Walmart I went to is 24 hours. It's one of those grocery store Walmarts, which is, I mean, it's alright. Um, I, the only reason I went to that particular place was because they have this bread here. For some reason, the local grocery store doesn't carry this, so we just have the, um, was the Lowe's near me, and maybe the Food Lion, only have, like, this stuff, this frozen Udi's brand. Yeah. 
So what I've discovered is if I take this, toast it, and then spread it with, do I have it over here? I put it somewhere else. Um, spread it with a bit, a bit of um, coconut oil, kind of like like butter. Instead of butter, use coconut oil. I'm sure I'm sure butter would be fine, but I think coconut oil gives it a bit, bit of sweetness or something. I don't know what I'm going for there. But a sweetness, then like sprinkle um, cinnamon and on it, and then take some like pancake syrup. It tastes a lot like French bread, so that's kind of awesome. Yeah, a little tid random tidbit there. Uh, let's see what else. Hmm. Like, what room do I want to tackle today? I need to clean my bathroom, definitely, but, um, my main problem is I have more shit than I have places to put shit. There you go, cursing, why not? Um, but you know what, I'm 33, if I want to, if I want to say shit, I'm going to say shit, so there you go. Uh, I'll put a little disclaimer there here and for those of you who have kids that watch me for some reason. I am like the weirdest person. I'm not I'm not like weird weird, but I'm like like I don't know why a little kid would be watching me. That's just that's odd, but hey, whatever. Um Yeah, I've got more things and I have places to put things. Mmm. Here you go. There you go. There's my living room. Yeah, this is why I don't have company. Totally. Yeah. <laughs> I wish it would focus on the moon. It's like shaky blur instead. I can z I can't even zoom out with it. Come on. There we go. Oh, too far away. There's a bird bath. Oh, that is shaky as 